know, his friends now know. And honestly, girls like like me, we don't meet guys left and right, a straight man to accept and to bring them bring us into their world. They you know, when your whole relationship from your perspective is based on the fact that he's a straight man that accepts you and is a straight man that looks good. Hmm. It makes you wonder. So are you actually with this person because you actually have an emotional connection towards them? Or are you with them just because they accept you and because they're hot? Because I can tell you that now, tell you this now, that is not healthy. That is not long lasting. Your relationship will be short lived. I mean, listen, as far as I'm concerned, generally speaking, before people decide to get married or even to be in a committed relationship, you have to make sure that you are emotionally connected. And being emotionally connected is definitely more important than anything else. Do you know why? Because you see, once you're emotionally connected, that means the intimacy part becomes even more amazing. And even just how you look at each other becomes even more beautiful, shall I say. Of course, before you get to the emotions, you've got to be attracted to each other, of course. The attraction comes first. The emotions comes after and then and anything else and anything else after that is just blossoming. These two don't have none of those things. <laughs> Hope it works with you guys. I mean, listen, I'm not against it. I just want it to be positive and work out for you because I don't want him to come over here and then you're heartbroken. One of my best friends and I ask her for advice, but do I take all of it? No, because you can't listen to everybody. Like yeah, the only reason why you don't want to take all of it because you can't listen to everybody is because you know that she's right. But you know that you're not in this relationship for the right reasons. You're in it literally just because of the way he looks and just because of the fact that he accepts you for you. But yet he barely even touches you. He doesn't give you intimacy nowhere near to the level that you want it. Nor does he give you intimacy nowhere near to the level that people in love should even have it. He gives you intimacy based on someone who's just looking to tolerate you. That's it. Hmm. And your relationship is your relationship. I want you to enjoy your beautiful day today. Don't think anything negative. I want to see pictures. All right, I love you. I mean, listen, we've all known that Nick has been delusional from, from the jump, but this delusion that Nick has had is getting worse upon worse, if anything, you know what I mean? Um, because the fact, the fact that she thinks that he can't do better than her is crazy. And I hate to say it, but she could do better than him. And I'll tell you why. Because you see, if you're not with somebody that's with you for the emotional connection, that means you can do better than them because there's nothing better than being with someone because you have an emotional connection with them. Like I said before, the, the attraction comes first based on looks. And then after that, the complete feeling comes with the emotion. And then after the emotion, your intimacy in life becomes even better than what it was when it first started. And you can only hope that stays healthy throughout the, the duration of your whole relationship. Because if it doesn't, cracks start to happen and then boom, bam. These two have a lack of communication. I mean, the attraction part, each is the, each, each is of their own. Do you know what I mean? Let them have that own opinion for themselves. You don't mind to tell people whether they're not the good looking people or not. You know what I mean? Well, you are attracted to what you're attracted to, but at uh, the end of the day, they don't, they don't have good communication. They don't have any emotion towards each other. I mean, maybe she does towards him, but not in the way that she should do. She has it more in the way of like, I'm just happy that you want to be with me and that, you know, uh, you're accepting me for me, which clearly is a lie. Because if he did, then he would be all over her way much more than he is. And also at the same time, this man has been playing around with biological women this whole time. That says something. And the fact that he even asked to have a free song with her and another woman. He didn't say another trans woman. He said another woman. That tells you a whole lot. <laughs> but hey, sometimes in life, people think that settling is what's going to keep them happy because it means they won't be lonely. When in reality, sometimes settling to be lonely is actually better than setting to be with someone that doesn't want you and you don't want them. But nonetheless, though, you guys let me know what you're thinking and we can talk about it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and of course, peace.